lady has uh, played the keyboard with a green hair. I like it. <laughs> when you were worshipping, I loved your song. When you really got into it, you shifted atmosphere. I don't know if you've seen it. I was looking. I always look. You always see me looking around in the spirit. You shifted atmosphere amazingly. And the Lord just said, there are many people that don't take you seriously out there in the world. And of course, they look maybe at the green air and think, oh, what's wrong with her? But they don't realize that through that, God has come and confirmed that you are an instrument of life. And he's positioning you right now into a place where you're going to speak. And some people might ignore it. They won't take you serious. But things will happen exactly as you have said. And God's changing that whole of that you will be honored for whom you are because God looks at your heart. That you will come to this place where you're going to walk and people's going to come to you and say, please help us. What does the Lord say? Please help me. I need truth in my life. And you're going to become a powerful instrument of truth to God. An instrument that gives life. I bless you in the name of Jesus. Where's the young man that played the acoustic guitar at studio? I don't normally do it because it's a, it's a bold statement and Edgar will tell you I make bold statements. <laughs> You've been called to full-time ministry. been called to full-time ministry never doubt because there's doubts there are many thoughts you're trying to work it out in the natural how i'm going to look after myself how we am i going to get finances how am i going to get position what is going to happen to me what's going to change the key is to step out on god's timing and i really believe it soon i really believe it soon but the lord said you can't stand with split legs you can't be in both arenas at the same time he chose you as an instrument of power so he said, you're under construction. Exactly that verse. You're under construction. And God wants to raise you up in all aspects of the fivefold. Plus you're blessed with the gifting of worship. Which are the keys. Because enter into my presence, my gates, through praise and worship. That's already inside of you. Now you need to know how to administrate all the gifts of the fivefold. But it's your time and it's your season. This is your year. Don't doubt it. Listen. It's going to be a sudden move. Bless you.